And that way I can give corrections if I can see you. Um, okay, we have a bunch of different levels joining us. So this is gonna be a pretty um, basic ballet class, um, but you can always modify if needed. Um, I'm going to be doing the right side with you. Avery will be facing the back for the right side. So you'll have both angles to look at. And then um, when you do left, I'll come over and look at your videos and give some corrections. Um, again, if you have any questions, just chat and send a message and we will get started. Okay, we're gonna start facing the bar for this first one just to warm up. Um, you're gonna be in first position. and get started really think about waking up your turnout and articulating your feet so you can really warm up your ankles and all those tiny muscles in your feet all right let me get the music going here we go Now, I want you to focus on bringing those heels forward. 
Good, really press down into the floor with the balls of your feet, and then lift your hips high in the opposite direction. Good, Delaney. Beautiful, good, Daniela. And plie, Madison, awesome, good. And finish. Good, guys, okay. Moving on to plie. side or back. One releve, one eleve, and then transition. Here we go. Really think about those big, deep demi plies, keeping your weight lifted for the grind. two, hold for one. Beautiful Ashton plie. And squeeze, finish. Fill your fifth position. Fill your glutes engaged. And relax. Beautiful, guys. Um, with your eleve and your releve, I really want you to think of keeping your weight lifted. So I especially see it on the eleve. Plie, releve, don't drop your weight or drop your pelvis down. That lift that you've established with your releve, you keep it and just use the inner thighs. Um, 
and your legs and the articulation and control of your feet to lower it and lift back up to your releve position, okay? All right, let's take left. shoulder blades are squeezing together. I want you to imagine you have a pencil in between your shoulder blades and you're squeezing it so your back is engaged. Focus is out towards the center. You hold for four. You hold for three. You hold for two. You hold for one. Big plie and stretch finish. And relax. Great job. Okay, plie's done. We're moving on to tendus. For all my little tendus, stretch to point. I really want you to think of pointing your legs out and having your arms in front of you, really lengthening those glutes of that leg arms. From first position, you can bear five, six, seven, and eight. Tendu front. One, close first. Two. lengthening your lines in your tendu, especially with the rond de jambe. So you establish your line to the front. I want you to think about stretching that working leg, creating the biggest quarter of a circle as you possibly can while still keeping your rotation, okay? For the whole first part, your arm is in second, so you can really focus on your legs and feet. And then when we take a little tag at the end of the phrase, 
which will be two tondus front and two tondus side. You're gonna incorporate the arm and really incorporate the eight palm all throughout the entire combination, okay? So when you're tonduing front, your head is out. When you're tonduing side, your head is straight forward. And when you tondu derriere, you're tilting your head, looking to your outside hand. Beautiful, Avery. All right, Coach Lee, you're good to go. Here we go, wake up those feetsies. Sorry, I gotta restart it. Six, seven, Tondus, remember to the front, your heel leads and your toes pull back. This is pretty slow, so you can really think about that articulation um, to the front and then to the back. Your toes will lead out and then your heel is going to bring your leg back in. So you're holding that first position no matter what position you are in. Awesome job, guys. Keep it up. We're going to go straight to left. Six, seven, and eight. Tondu one. Make sure you're using your A palm off. Now, right knee is out. Open, close first. Articulate through the foot. Hey, Chisholm, that's what I like to see. Good, Tondus. Back. Two. Beautiful, Carly. Marcella, you have ballet clothes on. I love it. Good, Mia. Nice, Madison. Good. Is that Paulina? Hello. Rhonda Jean. Thighs forward. Out.
So just again, ton lié means transfer of weight, okay? So you ton to your front leg, you think knees out, and your plié through fourth, transfer over to your ton du back, and make sure your weight is completely over this standing leg, okay? You close it, you transition, and your other foot does the two ton dues, okay? It's gonna be pretty slow, so you can still really work through those feet and feel the floor underneath yourself. So the floor is creating resistance for your tondu, okay? Um, to the side, you just do two tonliers. One, two, three, close front. Five, six, seven, eight, tondu out, tondu out, tondu out, and a little quick coupe. Remember, coupe means to cut, so I want that same sharpness um, quality that you would think of with scissors, okay? Then you reverse the whole thing. Let's do it. balancing, plie, and stretch. All right, let's do left. Here we go. Six, seven, and eight. One, knees out, transfer with control. Make sure you finish, you establish your position before you release, and relax. Nice work. Okay, I love how I'm seeing you really articulate through your uh, feet with the plies and the transfer and the tom lié. So nice job, keep it up. We're gonna now move on to dégagé. Dégagé means to brush to disengage, so I'm really wanting to see you use the floor, whether it's your kitchen <laughs> floor or the grass. <laughs> Um, really use the surface underneath your foot to find that resistance for your degage. Um, prepare five, six, seven, arm to face. It's going to take two degage rounds. One and two, three and four. Coupe. Extend it out 45 degrees. Six. One, quick coupe. Seven. Close eight. Five. One and two. Three and four, five, six, PK, close, back, reverse, two, three, four, 
all together okay so the theme for this combination is sharpness and precision okay so with your degages I want you to be very exact with your 45 degrees um, and establish it both times one and two three and four again coupe means to cut so you want a sharp quality with your coupe and immediately pull that knee out heels forward off your shin and then with resistance extend your leg out and then quick coupe close foot that all the way around, close, means to swing like a bell, so nothing else moves. It's just your inner thigh pulling your leg back and forth through first position, okay? Holding your turn out. And then the quick PKs obviously keep your hips still, just the working leg that does that, okay? So with the quality um, of your PKs, think of lifting up out of your standing leg with each one. All right, let's do it. You may recognize this song. Six, seven, and eight. It's a good song. Uh, it's Into the Unknown from Frozen 2. So hopefully you can sing along with left side. All right, here we go. Six, seven, and arm up. Brush out, out. Knee back, extend, PK. Side, two, three. Nice and mob. And close, two, three, four. PK around. Reverse. Good. And close. Two, three, four. PK. Plie up. Good. Knee back. Heel is forward. That's it, JC. Good job. Nice, Miss M. Good. Shoulders over hips. And lift to your fifth. Good, Paulina. Good, Danny. Beautiful, Madison. Nice job, Grace. And give a nice deep plie to finish. Killing it, Capri. And release. Beautiful, guys. Okay, we're going to transition to a little bit quicker of a degage now. Um, I'm going to give you the option to do this with one hand on the bar or two hands on the bar. Um, I'm going to show you with one hand on the bar, though, okay? Um, so we're going to first do it a little slower, and then after we get through four sets, we're going to speed it up, okay? So you're going to go degage in, two, three, hold, four. Degage in, two, three, hold, four. Degage in, two, three, four. Five, six, elevate. Then you go again. One, two, three, four, four, five, six, seven, hold, eight, six, one, 
like I said, we're gonna do that four times and it's gonna be pretty slow because again, I want you to really work through your feet and feel your inner thighs engaging. We'll do left, we'll come back and speed it all up to really fire up those inner thighs and glutes, okay? So the pattern is three, three, six, <laughs> and with an elevate. Okay, get ready. Six, seven, arm on ball. Okay, but try not to uh, release the booty and let it hang out and push back. You're staying lifted. Weight is over the balls of your feet, and it's just the inner thighs that are working, okay? After this exercise, I want your inner thighs and your glutes to be screaming. Okay, I'm going to try to do it with you. Here we go.
Hama usage. And balance. Two, shoulders down. Good, Megan Duffy, pull up in your hips. Lift that low belly, heels forward. Good, stretch your torso, Megan. Good, shake your fingers. And CrossFit. And day tour day. Show me how you finish. Lovely work, ladies. Awesome, awesome job. All right, moving on to a little bit slower. Um, we're gonna do Rana Jam. How are your inner thighs feeling? Good? Okay, good. Shake it out. Um, right leg is front. stretches, okay? Um, so Rana Jam, two passes. If my older ones want to take that on releve, be my guest. Really use your apoma on your arms. Really feel the breath um, with your upper body, okay? Dance it a little bit. Three, plie, Rana Jam, and then I want you to think pure technique with the slow Rana Jam, holding your turn out. Now you keep it for the four fast. One, two, three, Four, inner thigh pulls forward. Standing the knee is out over your toe. Pull the knee back. Extend, close, fifth, okay? And let's go ahead, when you brush front, take your arm to fifth. High passe, bring it to first. And then on the devil pay side, take your arm to second, just like Avery's doing. Close, the reverse of that Avery, can you go ahead and show that? Plie arm is front, bring it to first on the passe and then extend side with the devil pay. Okay, just so your arms and legs are coordinated. All right? Um, like I said, you'll have time after each side to do a little stretching, okay? All right, Rana Jam, turn out. That's the name of the game. Holding that turn out with your glutes and having fun with your upper body. Oh, you're gonna like this song too.
whatever you need here. those hips on all of your rond de jambes, okay? Um, I really just want the legs, to, so it's from the hips down that's doing all the work. Everything from your hips up, it gets to be beautiful and free, yeah? So this is, do you want to build a snowman from Frozen? I must have been on a Frozen kick, obviously, when I was making this playlist. Um, so have that enjoyment that little kids feel when they watch Frozen. Try to express that through your upper body, okay? I know it sounds cheesy, but just try it for me. <laughs> and six, seven, eight. Pause it. And up. Good. Track the foot up the front of the knee. And stretch your lines. Good. One. Straight legs all the way around. Good, Peyton. Keep those knees straight. Pull up on your shitty leg on the passe, then keep it side. One. Good. Kelsey Stroh, are you thinking of that working hip staying down? Good. Good, Jasmine. Good. Toes pull back. Yes, Jasmine. Beautiful, and I love your A come off. You look beautiful in your bedroom. <laughs> Mortimera, stretch. Anna Freed. Nice work. Lift up out of your hips. Good. Capri, beautiful job. Take a big deep plie, knees out. Now passe balance. Yes, ma'am. Awesome job. You are doing so, so good, and I'm so proud of you. Good, Audrey. Oh my gosh, you have a bar in your house too. You guys are so lucky. Good balance. I'm so proud of you too, Audrey. You're killing it. Pull that knee out to the side. Close fifth. And stretch. Good. Take your stretches. Whatever you did on the other side, make sure you do it on this side.
Nice job, Delaney. Really get your legs nice and stretched. Okay, um, so remember, I tell my little ones this all the time. Fondues are all about resistance. Okay, so you want to imagine. Okay, so she's really working both knees out to the side and resisting her leg forward, okay? That is going to strengthen the right muscles that you need to work for ballet, okay? So really stay mindful of that throughout this entire combination, okay? Um, from fifth, you're going to prepare five, six, seven, and eight. Fondue, one, and stretch. We Okay, I really just want um, you to focus on the resistance quality of your fondue, okay? All good? Your arm is in second the entire time. Here we go. Six, seven, and eight. Job. Let's do left. Six. Prepare. Stay over your working leg or standing leg. Sorry. Two. Three. Four. Good. 
Paulina, stretch it forward, plie, tighten it. Nice work. Inside leg, keep your arm out in second. Knees back, tall, back on the plie. Plie, up, two. Good, Ashton. Turn out, tight fifth, quick, add a two. Establish the position and then you balance immediately. trying to stay over your leg for this one. Six, ton, do three. like I said, is all about um, the position of your legs. I'm not too worried about height here. It's about establishing the 45 degrees and making sure that you're, you can establish the correct alignment in that height. And then with the next combination, we're going to work our legs a little bit higher. Okay. So energy in your legs and feet. Here we go. Left side. Sorry. Here we go. Six, prepare. Seven and eight. One, hold. And strike and strike. Side, hold, hold. Good energy. Back, hold, hold. Doubles. Feet, feet out. Feet, feet out. Feet, feet, hold. Good, Tori. One. Out, out. Side. Out, out. To the front. Out, out. Double back, double side, double front. Hold, relevant. Your weight is completely over your right leg. Good balance. Good, JC. Nice work. 
work, sister. Rotate that working heel forward. Yes, ma'am. And close, transition, arabesque. Stay lifted up over your standing leg. Pull your weight over your left foot. Tall back, your legs directly behind you. Taylor, beautiful. Now lift, close fifth, and plie. Good job. Really nice, Taylor. Um, good balances. Um, okay, we're gonna do a little extension exercise while you have something to hold on to. Um, I would recommend you doing this with two hands on the bar, but same thing is the last combination. You have the option to do one hand on the bar. Um, I'm gonna show up with one hand on the bar just so you can see it. You're gonna prepare seven and eight. Passe one. You're gonna lift your knee up two. Connect to passe three. Lift four. Five. Lift six. Seven. Lift eight. You're gonna double pay side. One. Two, pull three, pull four, time do, close, looking back. Then you're going to repeat from the back, and then we'll transition to the left, okay? So all it is, is we're really trying to mobilize the hip joint and um, make sure that we're getting all the, the kinks out of your hip flexors, okay? So one, you lift the knee up two. Again, connect three, lift four. Connect five, lift six. Connect seven, lift eight. Now you extend from that position. One, two, you hold it. Three, you hold it. Four, you lift, tendu, and then you close fifth, and we're gonna reverse it, okay? Again, you can do two hands on the bar or one hand on the bar. I will pause the music before we do left side, okay? Um, this is all, or this is, or you're thinking about extension. So from your développé, from your passe, the first step is to lift the knee, keeping the hip down, and then extend the leg to that knee height, okay? A lot of times, we like to pull off our standing leg when we lift the knee for our devil pay, and that's what I'm trying to get you out of the habit of doing, okay? So really think about staying supported over your standing leg. Let's do it. Six, seven, eight. Shake it out. Breathe. You're doing a fantastic job. Now let's go straight to left. Six, seven, and eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Dev, two, three, four. Leg behind the arm, and one, two, three, four. Six, seven, good Carly, I see you. Marcella, beautiful work. Rotate that working leg. Let me see that heel forward. Beautiful job, Capri. Kennedy, I see you, good. Who's that, Madison? Oh, beautiful, good. One, lift, two, lift. Good, now your hips stay quiet. Good, okay, shake out your legs. We're getting there, guys. Good job. Okay, we're gonna do a little quick développé um, before we do grand bat ma. Um, this is gonna be pretty easy because I know everyone's kind of limited on space. So from six, we're gonna prepare five, six, seven, eight. Développé, one, two, three, Four. We're going to brush through the first, attitude back. Five, six. You extend 
so I'm not going to make you do it again. Um, my young ones, whenever we do our développé front with our cambré, you can bring your foot down to tendu and just take a cambré back, like Avery doing with your arm and fist, cambré back like that, okay? Because um, I would rather you focus on keeping your hips aligned and your engagement than worry about the leg height, okay? My older ones, you can lift the leg, um, but really make sure you have the correct alignment. Okay, so just to review, devil pay one, two, you're out three, four, you brush back to attitude, five, six, you extend the arabesque, seven, eight, four counts down, one, two, three, four, come up five, six, tanu, seven, reverse, devil pay arabesque, one, two, three, four, brush attitude, five, six, you extend seven, eight, palm right back, either with your leg up or in tondu, one, two, hold three, four, come up five, six, tondu and close, okay? Here we go. This is a little Christmas action for y'all. We need the spirit of Christmas right now. Six. Devla pay. Two. Extend. Brush out. Again, littles, um, you should be able to do the releve, but if you want to take it flat, 
by all means, you totally can. Okay, really think about getting that passe position up in one count and held before you take it back down. Here we go. Using your porta bra arm is in fifth for front, side for second, and front stretch de lager to the derriere. Six, seven, and eight. One. position. You're going to rise up one, two, lower three, and four. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, lower three, four, five, six, lower seven, eight. You coupe your right foot and you repeat. Up one, two, lower three, four. Rise up six, seven, eight. Four times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You switch feet. Left foot in coupe. Rise up one and two with straight legs. Elevate up two, three, four. Rise up two, three, four, four times. Then you're gonna lower back to parallel. You're gonna give me 16 elevates, okay? Then you have a four count break. In those four counts, you establish your first position, you turn out, and you're gonna repeat the whole thing in a turned out position, okay? When we do our coupes, we're gonna place your coupe to the back of your working leg, okay? Just like that, okay? Starting with your right foot first, okay? Um, I'll call it out too, so if you forget, you know it's coming. But enjoy this music. Like I said, it goes out to all of you who I miss so much, yet I'm so proud of all of you for sticking through this. Y'all are truly an inspiration. So I love all y'all. Mwah! <laughs>
I know you're limited on space. So go ahead and grab some water. Um, if you do have a bar, um, you can move it. Create some space around you. We're just gonna do a few combinations in the center um, to establish your balance, and then you will be good to go, and your ballet will be over for the day, unless you do on demand, which is awesome. <laughs> okay, so grab some water. Be back in 30 seconds. Four tendus quasi derriere. Um, four tendus écarté devant. Remember, in écarté position, you're looking up at your elbow crease right here, and you want that lift in your chin. You're showing your left cheek. Um, and then you plie front, open everything towards the front, feel your heels rotate, and then tonly a nice transition. Here we go. Oh, 
break in there. Um, good, just remember when you do your plie front, heel is forward, I want you to expand your arms back. So you're imagining and trying to touch the two side walls with your arms, okay? So you're really expansive, you have a proud chest, and that way your position is strong and you're taking up space rather than falling or sinking in, okay? You wanna be expansive with your movement, okay? Um, we're gonna go ahead and move on just for time's sake. Um, a quick little degage, okay? So from first position, you're gonna prepare five, six, seven, right foot. So one, two, three, four. Close that, six, seven, eight. Then you're gonna get out, coupe down, pause, and then you're gonna take one, Thank you. 
Okay, this is gonna be to a beautiful song. This is Never Enough by, or from The Greatest Show. This is one of my all time favorite songs. So really live it up. Um, I know you miss dancing in the studio, but you can still find that enjoyment if you really give yourself to the music and dance for yourself. Let the music bring emotion out of you. Okay. Keep your pirouettes, so and you're not going to do too much. Um, you're just going to play. Um, from fifth, right leg front. jump combination and you will be good to go friends here we go so proud of y'all yourself shin splint so really use your plie to cushion your jump okay you're just going to take first position one two three four relevé relevé go second two three 
strong together. Use your plie and point your feet. Love y'all. Here we go.